Leonardo da Vinci was truly a genius of the Renaissance era. Drawn in 1487, his Vitruvian Man has fascinated scholars and provided historians with incontrovertible evidence that if da Vinci were alive today, he would be way into Tekken. Here at the Exertion Games Lab, we've taken our Uno Joy project and turned da Vinci's dream into reality. Using the arrows circumscribed around Mr. Man here, we're able to navigate through the screen. And then when we want to unleash an attack, we just press the appropriate lift. So this project is using the capacitive pencil drawing technique that we've shown off in our blog already. We've got these simple drawn-on arrows that are connected to the paper clip through just another drawn-on line. This provides a level of connection to the Arduino. For the limbs though, you don't see any markings. That's because the advantage of a capacitive sensor is that it'll actually sense through the paper. So we actually have just big pads that we've drawn underneath that similarly connect to their own set of paper clips that we're able to then pull back to the Arduino. So as you can see, the Arduino is connected up through wires to the paper clips, and then there's one small resistor for each line that pulls up the signal when we want it to. This way, we can go ahead and have the inputs come in from the paper, go into the Arduino, and then get sent out as native PlayStation controller signals. 